you look terrific. Now, Thank you very much. Now, dating anyone? What's going on? How are things going? Um, no, I think dating kind of leads to marriage and then to babies. And I don't really have a problem with the babies so much yeah. as I have a problem with the people who have the babies. Who complain? You know, people who have yeah, babies. Like yeah. I have a lot of girlfriends who are having babies, and they complain about it all the time. Yeah. They're like, my baby weight, my baby weight. I can't lose my baby weight. You're like, your baby's seven. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're a fat ass now. Okay. You might want to put down the chalupa for two seconds. It has nothing to do with your baby anymore. It's like from when you were a baby. What baby weight are you talking about? <laughs> well, I could. Yeah. So you're you're not thinking of having a baby yourself? No, no. It's like then they talk in baby talk, and you're like, oh, how old's your son? And they're like, oh, 72 months. It's like, what, what does that even add up to? <laughs> Can you imagine me going to a bar and be like, hi, I'm 214 months. <laughs> Who talks like that? No, no I'm not dating. I'm not no. dating anybody. I'm single and available, everybody. Wow. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Apparently not for long. Now you're doing a late night talk show, obviously. Did you, did you tr think of other genres like reality shows? Do you have any interest in those? I think there's a real big problem going on with reality shows. Yeah. And Kevin, you might be a good person to ask this question. I brought a picture with me right, yeah. tonight. Yeah. Why are there women competing to be Flava Flav's girlfriend? <laughs> there are women on a television show yeah. that go on a weekly basis trying to win this man over. I would rather hook up with a relative. <laughs> Do the same weekend. Wow. Obviously, it would have to be a long weekend, but... <laughs> so you're not a fan of the reality genre? No, I mean, they're all so silly now. You know, like, Mark Burnett has a pirate show. Oh, yeah, what's this? It's a new... Uh, it's like Master Pirate, pirate, master pirate or, or whatever. Yeah. It's like, did anybody tell him pirates aren't... They don't exist anymore. Like, yeah. Pirates of the Caribbean isn't based on a true story. <laughs> That's I mean, so old school, too. It, yeah. It come was, with one leg going, sorry, seen it. Would he like commandeer a carnival cruise ship? Like, what, what, what is he gonna do? Have you ever so done that? Have you ever performed on a cruise ship? That's my nightmare, actually. Oh, it, well, a carnival cruise ship is a real yeah. nightmare. I don't know if anybody's been on a carnival cruise, no. but they don't even like water in the pools. It's like going to a sizzler on water, and you're stuck for four days. <laughs> <laughs> it's the worst cruise line in the world. A sizzler on water. Like, I like that. Off sizzler the ship. On water. <laughs> I went with my girlfriend once. She forced me to go on that four-day cruise from LA to Ensenada. Right, you know? right. And so, like, three days into the cruise, I go, "This is the worst cruise line in the history. We're gonna have to jump ship." Okay, pay a Mexican to drive us to the border right, right. so we can have a decent New Year. She goes, Chelsea, we could get violated. I'm like, at least we'd have a good New Year. Right. <laughs> now tell us about your new show. What's, what's it going to be about? We're going to make fun of celebrities. Right. You know, Britney Spears when she decides to show off her Hot Pocket or Paris Hilton, right. you know, yelling for her mommy when she gets taken off to jail. It's like, you're going to have 18 mommies when you get there. Relax, okay? No. Um, <laughs> I ain't never here. been in Paris before. <laughs> <laughs> now you're gonna... still time. Yeah, I know. You know it's not late now. Are you you don't need no passport. This Just is my time, Robin. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you trying to book any big celebrities? Are you... um, I don't think anyone would really talk to me. Because, really? you know, I say a lot of bad things. Oh, about people when I think it's true. Like Angelina Jolie, I said some things about her taking. I just don't understand why she can't adopt a baby from the country she lives in. Like, what is she, anti American? Like, you know, there's a lot of children in America that need homes. Instead, she goes to Vietnam and adopts a baby and then changes his name to Pax. You know, I mean, you don't change somebody's name after three years old. He's probably running around the house. She's like, Pax, Pax. He's like, who the hell's Pax? You know? And, and then her statement was, well, he's adjusting to his family life really well. He is very strong. I'm like, he's three, okay? He's not strong. He doesn't know if he's, he probably doesn't even know he's Asian yet, okay? He certainly doesn't know he's going to be a horrible driver. <laughs> It's all like now. I line to open now. I'm calling you now. The woman on the talk show. <laughs> we can rule out Angelina Jolie. Open now. Calling now. We just bought yeah, your home. She holds a grudge. She holds a grudge. So yeah, that's. So who would be your out. ultimate guest? Who's well, obviously ultimate? not you. Right. <laughs> love to have some real celebrities on, but yeah. it's hard to do that. Then, you know, you have to be really, really nice, and you yeah. can't say what you want. And yeah. yeah, you can. Well, you can. You can. You can. You just did. <laughs> I'm sure the Asian guests will go, no, please book me now. <laughs> Come on now. You're Send your letters to. You've been soaking in it for two hours now. <laughs> Now, do you, are you doing sketches on this show as well? Are you gonna do We're going to 
to do uh, field segments. Like, we do funny things. Like, we'll take, you know, you go on the street and do your jaywalking right. stuff. So, um, obviously, we ripped you off and right. did, like, well, an offshoot. <laughs> well, we do a thing. We do a who would you rather have sex with game where we give them a real challenge. But not just sex, like straight sex. You have to, like, take it up a notch. Like, so I'll say, okay, who would you rather have sex with? Michael Jackson while he's hanging you off a balcony. Yeah. Or Siegfried and Roy while they're hanging you in front of a tiger. <laughs> You really have to take it up a level to really That's play that game. That's a tough one. Off. I would have to spend some time thinking about well, that. Well, think about it. You, you have to choose, otherwise your whole family is kidnapped. Yeah. <laughs> so it's kind of a reality show is it's what totally you're doing. Reality, it's totally based on a true story. Wow. Now, do you have a sidekick on this show? I have my little Mexican midget, or I'm sorry, nugget. Um, yeah. I have to be politically correct sometimes. You can't say little person, then the Irish people go, it's not a little person. Right. No. Oh, sorry. Would you like Thank some more you. ice for a problem? No, no. <laughs> I'm just happy to be near you. Uh, I can tell. Well, yeah. listen, the show that. starts July, July 16th on the E! Entertainment Network, Chelsea Handler Show. Chelsea, thank, thank you, brother. Be right back with Big and Rich right yeah. after this.